Israel says that 12 employees of the UN Special Aid Agency for Palestinians participated in the attack. The allegations are very, very serious, with the terrorists reportedly using UN vehicles and facilities during the attack. Some of the UN staff members kidnapped Israelis. Others provided logistical support for the massacre. And America and over a dozen other top donor countries suspended their funding in response. It's important to note that these are still allegations. They fired nine of the employees right away. Two of them were confirmed dead and they're working on confirming the identity of the last one. The organization also launched an investigation into the matter and top UN officials say that they're horrified. And even the Biden administration, which is hugely supportive of the UN, said that it's taking the matter highly seriously.